this. And first of all, wh where are you now? Which party, which movement, formation? Okay, why, why, don't, why don't I start with that and, and right, finish okay. with what just, you've just said? Just respond <laughs> Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. Now, um, you know, Sam, I think, um, let, let's look at, at this with, um, with, with a, a bit of perspective of history. And, and, and that's the way probably I would want to go. Mm -hmm. uh, and it may help to inform, in my view, what, what's happening. First, um, Sam, it's important to say that um, mm -hmm. the consequences, first remember that uh, uh, political negotiations and the outcomes ultimately are about interest, mm -hmm. either of the group or the person. And, and so whatever you see happening, whether it is the negotiations about with, with Oka, with any of the players, it has the element of the interest of that group or the persons mm -hmm. that are in there. So, so uh, no, none of the players is going to be acting ultimately in the interest of the other person and selflessly. So, 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 so that, that, that we, must, we must make very clear. Uh, number two, uh, Sam, let's, let's just take a quick relook at, 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 at these negotiations and the people who are there. Uh, first, look at Mother Karua and uh, remember her history a little bit. Uh, re remind, remind ourselves mm -hmm. that Mother Karua was one of the negotiators during the Grand Coalition government. Mm -hmm. and, and you can now relate to the kind of negotiator she is. It was a tough negotiation. Remember, at one point she had to be, you know, as, as rumor was, she had to be thrown out <laughs> because of her saying she was making things almost impossible to move. Uh, I don't know whether you followed that during mm -hmm. that time. Mm -hmm. but, but the essence of it was that she negotiated hard and tough, you know, du during that uh, negotiation. Mm -hmm. And they wanted to make sure that at the end of the day, uh, when uh, the agreement is signed, that they have something they can take away. If, if uh, I would, I would um, probably also, also re reminisce in, in that history, that time, the perception of the people was that the, whatever was taken uh, as, the, as, as, as the giveaway to the PNU side that time. The rumor had it, and indeed, the conscience of many people around, uh, especially like the Mount Kenya region, believed that it was Mother Karua who, who was credited with that negotiation. Mm -hmm. And, 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 and so, so uh, that, that would inform you that when she's in a, in a group, what kind of negotiation would you have? Mm -hmm. Now, uh, then uh, look at Kalonzo Musioka. Kalonzo Musioka, uh, you know, he, he's been branded many times, you know, Melo, Tamelo, Nguyen, you know, Chameleon, or whatever, you know, so many things that he has no position. In my view, what, is, what that is likely to do to a person who has had the kind of history he's had in political leadership is to get him to first want to assert that he is not the kind of person he's been descri described as. And so when he goes into this kind of a negotiation. Is it working? He, he, would, he would want to uh, ensure that because he took a position, he pursues that position. So you have these two people in, in, in this uh, coalition. Mm -hmm. And then and now reflect back to what you saw uh, as the headlines in the, in the standard. Mm -hmm. And you can see there, Kalonzo Musioka's face is one of the many. And, and the central one seems to be Raila Odinga. And, and so these are people who are negotiating with this kind of history. So let me say this um, uh, for, 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 for that mind, for, for that purpose, that I think mm -hmm. that um, ultimately what these gentlemen are, and ladies are trying to do mm -hmm. is to ensure, in my view, that they get a deal that will not be like, and, and, and I, do, I would want to uh, urge uh, our people, let's be fair on this. And I, I'm not a member of Walker, by the way, uh, because you've asked me that question. Mm -hmm. but, but, but I'm saying that uh, throughout the life of parliament from 2017 up to now, one of the issues that have all consistently been raised by members of parliament, and especially from that side of the, of, 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 uh, the you know, opposition, if you like, right. has been that the undoing was the failure to honor an agreement they had signed. You know, because I'm in the House, and uh, this is an honest discussion. And this, they have been saying that we signed an agreement, we're supposed to have shared funds, you know, with, uh, with, the, with the ODM, yeah. mm -hmm. and this didn't happen, we were shortchanged, and indeed that's what you saw led into the fallout. Consequently, even the Tangula was removed, and, uh, you know, James Arango took over, and, and so on. You know, first wipers seem to be going on its own. And so I think, informed by all that, the right. likelihood is that that negotiation would not be so easy when you have those people. At the end of the day, uh, I believe 
that uh, uh, what, what should be given, and we've signed a law that, that, that secures, or rather we, we passed a law that, that secures those, those kind of interests, is to ensure that uh, uh, these gentlemen and ladies get uh, the fair share they're supposed to get. And I want to conclude that some by saying mm -hmm. that the consequences of, a poli of political failure and they have been felt firsthand by somebody like Kalonzo Musioka are very personal. Because uh, once, once you have lost either in this kind of uh, negotiation, you, you live out in the cold alone for the, right. next, uh, for the next five years. Okay. And Kalonzo has been out in the cold for five years. Uh, Mother Karua has Actually, been out in the since cold. 2013? Yeah, yeah, more. Uh, ten, ten years. Mm -hmm. uh, now, uh, Mother Karua has been out there. Same, same thing. Mm -hmm. And so these are people who know that if we negotiate and we don't get it right, mm -hmm. that we are, we are likely to be out in the cold for the, for the next few days. All right. So, so I, I think, in, in, in my view, that would be informing what seems to be the rigidity now. So, so uh, Senator, my question on where you are politically. Uh, one is that that I'm going to be running for governor of Kiambu. I made that decision that after, after my running, I also went to the USA and, uh -huh. and, decided, that, and right. decided that our ticket for the presidency then may be more viable in the, in the year 2027. Mm -hmm. So, anyway, uh, so you know, you know as, 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 a, as, as, a, as, a, as a confirmed position, uh, some I'll be running for governor of the county of Kiambu. Uh, number two, I will be having my lounge on the 20th. So I will invite you. Do you know what party, what formation? Uh, that's why I'm going to be, uh, to be launching and uh -huh. revealing to my, to my, to my uh, people and my followers okay. how we shall be. Okay. Because I've got enough funds. All right, I hear you.